this experimental setup is an in an internal startup for pacemakers with thermal harvesting technology. There are about 3 million people with pacemakers throughout the world and is implanted for people of any age. Even children are implanted with pacemakers. A pacemaker is a small device which is implanted just below the collarbone and weighs about 1 ounce. The drawback of the pacemaker is that the dead battery. The batteries limit the lifetime of the pacemaker. As the batteries should be replaced once in 10 years through surgical procedures. One of the alternative methods to, to supply an implantable pacemaker is thermal harvesting te technology. This is done by harvesting body temperature of the person and converting into electrical energy which supplies power to the pacemaker. Here the thermoelectric device called Peltier is used. This Peltier absorbs both hot and cold temperature of the body. The maximum voltage required for the pacemaker to operate is about 5 to 13 volt. If the converted energy Electrical energy is less than the required supply for the pacemaker, then the boost converter is used. The boost converter used steps up, steps up the input voltage and gives high voltage than input. Pacemaker is not necessary to operate every time. Pacemaker is implanted to a person only in the case of abnormal heart rate. So it should be checked whether there is abnormal or normal heart rate and then the boost converter operates. To check the heart rate, the human heart pulse cannot be given in demo. So PWM pulse is given which is similar to human pulse. PWM pulse is generated using VHDL in models. This is the VHDL code for the generation of PWM. Now, the PWM pulse is generated by compiling the program. The program is compiled and the inputs are given through the objects. So the object window is opened and here the clock period should be given and clear the value may be either 0 or 1. We will give 0 for first and then VDD we can give 500 or 100 it's our wish scale value is given and D is the input for D flip flop it's 8 bit so we are giving 8 bit input value and add to the wave Now we can change clear value and uh, input value. See the PWM pulse is generated. For various inputs, the PWM pulse is generated and then is the PWM pulse is generated here. PWM pulse is generated into the PIC microcontroller. This, this is the PIC microcontroller. Uh, the PWM pulse is dumped into this controller. And here the counter is uh, counter is used and the counter counts the number of pulses. And then given to the comparison logic. The comparison logic compares the normal heart rate and the counted heart rate. The normal heart rate of human being is 72 beats per, cell, per minute and the, uh, it compares uh, whether the uh, heart pulse is normal or abnormal and due to the boost converter. Then the boost converter operates. For uh, applying body temperature to the Peltier, uh, instead of uh, applying uh, body temperature, we are, we are applying uh, through soldering machine. The boost converter boosts up and gives uh, about uh, 4 to 5 volt which is required for the pacemaker to operate.